Cincinnati City Council is looking to make a busy street safer, approving a plan to narrow a portion of Harrison Avenue. This will mean fewer driving lanes in an effort to slow traffic down. Local 12's Tyler Madden looks at the plan and has reaction from families in the area. It is essentially a mini highway through the west side. Cincinnati City Council member Mark Jeffries describing the three mile stretch of Harrison Avenue between Queen City and Kling. The $8 million project will cut the number of lanes from four down to three. The reason, slowing down drivers to make roads safer. It's about time. It is. It's about time. Uh, they should have did this a long time ago. Tobin Frost says he's seen many accidents on Harrison over his 12 years living in the area. Just at the end of July, one person was killed and multiple others injured after an accident there. Police say they're looking at speeding as one of the factors in the crash. Every week, seven to ten days, the power goes out. Either from somebody hitting a pole or accident coming up the hill or somebody hitting a pole or accident going down the hill. Constant speeding raising concerns for not just safety on the roads, but around them as well. It's scary because my kids, they stand for the bus stop right there on Harrison and Bracken Woods. Um, people fly by, come around that corner like super fast, and I'm scared to leave them up there waiting for the bus. The city's plan will tackle safety on sidewalks, creating bump outs extending the curb for pedestrians. It's about saving people's lives who are not just living there, but also traveling through there. I would appreciate they did something, and I'm pretty sure a whole lot of other people would too. Um, it's a problem. It's a big problem. It's only going to get worse. The project is set to get underway in 2025. You can always get local stories right here on YouTube, but go ahead and hit that subscribe button to get notifications to stay in the know.